Yo guys, welcome back to the channel and today we are back with the first part of a brand new series coming your way every single Thursday. The name needs work, but it is going to be called TikTok Thursdays. Pretty self-explanatory on the Discord. I have made a channel and all of you guys can send as many TikToks as you want into that channel for me to react to every single Thursday. If this does well, we'll continue it. If it doesn't, it was a trial and error, but it is what it is. I'm excited for this. I'm intrigued to see what you guys have sent to me. But without further ado, let's not waste any more of your time. I'm going to move to the side here. And potentially, if I've done this right, the TikTok should come down there. So without any further ado, let's get listening. Oh, God, what's this, what's this first one then? Dear Man City fans, this is not going to go well. Okay, let's see, let's see. Come on, then. Dear Man City fans. Players, passion off fans. <laughs> I hope this music's not going to be copyright by the big man. Next up, if football and golf switch commentary, knockout takes, Almunia saves, knockout follows in, Almunia saves again. <laughs> what is this, man? Absolutely astonishing. Now, here come Watford. Forestieri. This is actually winding me up. <laughs> Here's Hog. Deeney. Oh my god, no, no, no. That was horrible. I didn't like that. Do not scratch your eyes. You really are seeing the most extraordinary finish here. I no, 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 no. Who sent that? Stocky, you're a mean man. That was out of order. Next up. Man like Derby County, yeah? Wayne Rooney doing the great escape. Come on. Look at this run. Come on. Pass out wide. Back in. Tom Lawrence. Tom Lawrence! Oh, mate. If Wayne Rooney pulls off this great escape, I am so, so pumped for him. Listen. United till I die, of course, but I'm getting so much enjoyment watching Derby County and Wayne Rooney this season. They're like my second team right now. Up the Rams. I need to get a Wayne Rooney Derby kit. I, I, unboxing video coming soon, boys. But, oh, yeah, that is a mid one. I like that. Next up. <laughs> oh, Bruno for pass into Rashford. <laughs> Touch. Oh, I was at this game. This was the 3 2 versus Atalanta. Solid finish. I was at that game. There is a match review on the channel, I'm pretty sure. I've got really confused what I was for a second. Don't cry on it, it's fine. That's more like it. Lift that trophy. Oh. oh god, that was the Barcelona final, wasn't it? Oh no, not the walk off. Who sent that in? Who sent that? Blaze, Blaze Haste. Nah, man. Oh, that made it emotional. Do you know why? 37 years old, he turned the other day. He's starting to get benched so much more for Man United. He's got 13, 14 goals, I think, this season, but. It's coming to an end, boys. Oh, no. Blaze, man. How are you going to make me cry this early on a Thursday morning? Oh, God. I've seen the thumbnail for the next one as well. <laughs> Blaze. <laughs> this day was horrible. I was so excited for this. Oh. Oh, Ollie. Oh, 
That made me sad. That Europa League final was horrible. Mostly because I really wanted Oli to lift that trophy. Just one trophy at United. Roll the clip. These TikToks are banging, but I really hope this music isn't like copyright or something like that, because that's what worries me, but I'll put all the people who did it in the description or whatever. That is not where I thought that TikTok was going. That was the worst, like, two months of my life. Ah, oh, the last three penalty shootouts I've seen. We lost to Middlesbrough. The Euros final. No, man. I just want to see England win one trophy. Nations League, World Cup, Euros, whatever. Just once in my lifetime. That was the best chance we're going to get. Penalty shootout. We go 1-0 up. Luke Shaw. Wembley Stadium. That was our best chance. Yes, this was such a wicked time, man. This was the best summer of my life, one of them anyway, considering it was in COVID. Oh, what a summer this was, man. What a summer. That Luke Shaw moment my life did. I'll tell you what, that Luke Shaw goal was good. I actually think the feeling from the Harry Kane penalty when we beat Denmark was equally as better to be this year. Mm. Oh, what a summer. Roll the clip. Touching you! Sweet Caroline! <laughs> Let's be honest, the last five, six games, you think Manchester play very well? No. You know that? Everyone know that. We, can, we have time to improve? Yes, we have. We have a potential uh, squad, we have new manager. Why we don't believe that we can do it better? We have to believe, we have to be positive to try to change the things, you know, to play as Manchester United fans want. And The problem with stuff like that, right? And like, listen, we're Man United, the biggest club in the world, or one of the biggest clubs at least. We're just not as good as we used to be. It's a plain and simple fact. And people are putting us to the Ferguson standards when we shouldn't be at the Ferguson standards right now. And every single time we step on the pitch, we're compared to that team. And it's just, I don't know. I really want us to come back to the glory days, but we're a little while off yet, boys. David De Gea could save the fucking Man, Titanic. Right. I said it before, right? David De Gea, Manchester United's greatest ever goalkeeper. Shot stopper, Schmeichel, Van der Sar, mate. Top, top, top. Best keepers in their time. David De Gea is all better than both of them. He just doesn't have the trophies behind him. Or as good of a defence in front of him. I genuinely believe that. When she was just a girl, she expected the world, but it flew away from her reach. So she ran away in her sleep and dreamed of para, para, paradise, para, para, paradise, para, para. Fair enough, fair enough. Celtic fan coming in there. Fair enough. Love that. Love that. Right then, that looks to be where we are ending things. Massive thank you to every single one of you who sent a TikTok in. Hopefully, there's not a copyright thing because obviously every single one of them had music in it. So I don't know how that's going to work out, but I'll leave all the actual TikToks people's names in the clip. So hopefully it should be all right. But if it works, result. If it doesn't, this is the one off um, episode and I've got a copyright claim, but <laughs> we'll see how this goes. But um, yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy. Smash the like if you did and make sure you guys do go follow the channel Discord. I'll put the Discord link down below in the description. Press that and you can be involved in sending TikToks for next week's uh, video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Smash the like if you did. Subscribe if you're new. Let me know down below your favourite TikTok of the episode. And can Manchester United ever return to their genuine peak um, like we were under Ferguson? See you next time, boys. Peace.